How's it going everybody? Wildman Wes here and welcome to a interesting episode of the Merch Unleashed. As you can see, we've got quite a lot of boxes to go through. I've been busy with work coming back from furlough and everything and uh, sad to say there's going to be a time where I might have to stop on this series because I'm going to be relocating. But that doesn't mean we can't have some fun before we go for a little while. However, something just seems not right about this. I think I know why. Hello! Hefe Wisen's gonna be here helping me unbox all of this stuff, and we're gonna talk about it in detail. There's, There's a lot of boxes! Yeah, there is a lot of boxes, but you know what? We'll get through it as quick as we can, so let's get so started. For our first box, we have Pro Wrestling Crates. Honestly, I can't remember what month this is, but we're just going to deal with it. Oh. It has the tape. Oh, the yeah. tape is the most secure thing in the mailing world. Ah, I'll get into that on one of the next boxes. There you go. Alright, so we have our... Uh, oh, this is August 2020, so this is our little cheat sheet we're going to The shirt that we're going to have right away... <laughs> Childhood achieved. We have a G.I. Joe Sergeant Slaughter shirt. This is great because it's just. I can really appreciate that. I love the artwork on that one. That one's really cool. Sergeant Slaughter in an itty bitty ditty bag. So, I mean, I always loved watching Sergeant Slaughter as a kid in pro wrestling, also in the G.I. Joe movie. Uh -huh. I mean, so yeah. The next one for. <laughs> Some of the old school wrestling fans and new school wrestling fans, we have the broken slash woken Matt Hardy. I mean, <laughs> I love how he's reinvented himself from being Team Extreme to kind of this, you know, you know, the master of deletion. Like, delete, delete. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Hefe hasn't watched wrestling in a while, so he's just kind of, you know. I'm enjoying it. I can appreciate it. Yep. Next up from Micro Brawlers, we have. Honky Tonk Man. Oh, God. Talking about Chopper again. You know that guy? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. This is definitely going to be going next to my uh, Tommy Dreamer one that I got last time. So I've got something old, something new. Next thing up, we have Before the Big Leagues. This is from the Wrestling Network. It's a DVD. So looks like a lot of the... Uh, not... Oh, okay. So I'm seeing a couple of the names on here. Uh, MJF versus Ace Romero. One of the matches on here is Jungle Boy versus David Arquette. <laughs> and, well, and plus, David Arquette just put out a new, like, kind of mockumentary documentary about him doing pro wrestling to yeah. this day to kind of keep everything going because ever since 2000, when WCW had him come in as being the world champion, that's kind of the, the you know, the decline of WCW uh, for sure. Yeah. Got a bag. Oh, it's a nice bag. From the Gun Club. What's right. that? Besides what a gun club is. Gun club. Oh, shoot. Um, my wrestling fan friends out there are probably going to look at me like I'm a complete noob. It's I've okay, because I don't know it. <laughs> yeah, I, um, I haven't really watched a lot of AEW, I believe. That's where I they're gotcha. from, the All Elite Wrestling. Like That's the newest one that came out, right? The one that came out uh, mm -hmm. yeah, recently, last few years. Yeah. Television. yeah, I heard really good things about it. I, I have other friends that. that Next up is it. the collector's pin. This is. Colt Cabana, all right. One of uh, the Midwest's, you know, greats, kind of, you know, I mean, I much in a long time other than, you know, doing things you know, in the indie circuit, but you know what? You know, he's a great you know, persona, great profession. I've seen a lot of stuff he does on YouTube. So yeah. Very nice. Next up we have the autograph. Let's see what we got in here. Gotta be careful. By the looks of things on the cheat sheet, uh, Walter, you know what? Ladies and gentlemen, I am going to cheat. I am going to, I'm gonna Google this because, like I said. He's punching him so hard in the chest that his chest is rippling. Like, is that Photoshop? Or is that the real thing? Oh, it's Walter Hahn from NXT. See, I, I haven't watched NXT in a long time, so. <laughs> Bear with me, folks. I don't have the network right. He's punching a booby. He's punching a booby. He's he's punching a booby. All right. Well, wrestling fans, sorry that uh, I haven't given you 
what you deserve today. But hopefully the next time when I get a pro wrestling crate, I'll have a little more knowledge apart from the old school like Sergeant Slaughter. Well, time to move on to two of eight. You ready, Hefe? Numero dos. Next up, we have the July Geek Fuel box. So I don't remember a lot of the things that are in all these boxes just because I haven't been really up to date with the website when I was uh, ordering these. So we just have to wait and see what happens. First up, we'll... Ooh, Harry, Harry Potter, Hogwarts. Uh, note cards include 10 blank note cards and 10 envelopes, so... The Hogwarts foil note. Uh, it's a really nice crest on there. You look... Yeah? Make it, make it look like a really important letter. I'll be honest. I've never really watched or read Harry Potter. You don't... You don't, you don't My girlfriend has, so, you know, they're, they're going to her. So. She'll enjoy this. Yes, she will. They're classy. Yep. Classy. Classy with an I. This is oh. Tales from Space, Back to the Future. I believe this is the um, in leaf that they give to let you know what's all in there. Yep. We're not going to look at that. And we have oh. Jaws 19 from <laughs> Back to the Future 2. Speaking, Speaking of. Oh, oh, holy crap. Okay, we have from Nano Hollywood Rides, DeLoreans. All three that of is them. really cool. They're like little mini, like from the first, second, and third films. That's really awesome. Okay, you know what? I know I talk about how I'm getting rid of things and I end up getting more things. Isn't that so cool? I'm not getting rid of this. I actually do have a Hot Wheels DeLorean that I might be getting rid of. If anybody's really interested, let me know and I might send it to you. Next up is uh -oh. a strange scarf from Stranger Things. Now, I have to admit something. I have not seen all of Stranger Things. I've seen the first season. I, I haven't watched it I since. Finally I finally got into amazing. it. I finally got into it. Uh, I'm looking forward to the next season. But that's so. great that this is literally just a, it's a bandana. It's just a, it's a bandana like that you can wear as a face covering. That's fantastic. Especially with everything going on that, right that's now. That's the whole point. That is so cool. And we have so our cool. Geek Feel sticker. Oh, is it? Straight up Stranger oh, yeah. Things. Looks, looks like Stranger Things, yeah. That is cool. And last but not least, the shirt. Oh boy. Oh, it's Jaws. <laughs> Am ah. Amity Beach Island. It's a beautiful day. The beaches are open. <laughs> that now that's fantastic. great. The next time I go to Universal Studios, wherever I go, the, yeah, I'm wearing that shirt because that's awesome. That, yeah, that is very awesome. I'm. Well, so far so good on some other great boxes. Now, place. So now for our third box, we have from Bam, our horror box. Ah, oh, I do horror. love these horror. Horror. Ooh, piece of bad paper. No. This is volume five, box number seven. A little cheat sheet over here. Oh, we're gonna have to get a coin because uh, we'll get that in a second. Figure it out. Get our figure it out. Fuck, figure it out. Yep, we have a uh, zombie year. Ooh, zombie year. Or, or you might have something in the box. First thing, we have a fan art pin. This is from the 2001 horror thriller 13 Ghosts. Very cool. Yep. Very detailed. Oh, yeah. I, I do love the BAM horror pins that I've been getting so far. Oh, yeah, for the art go. select card. Ash Williams from Evil Dead. That's awesome. Oh, man. Love it. And this is from artist Jason Miller. He's been doing a lot of great work on BAM with the, the, the fan art. And um, I, I can never get enough of it, really. Very nice. Oh, 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 we have Open Any Door. This key looks familiar. It's a prop replica from the film The Skeleton Key. I'll be honest, I've never seen the movie. But you know what? I've seen this key. Interesting. 2015 Skeleton Key? I never saw that. Well, I think that might be on the list for a future movie review. Well, sounds like it. Bastas das, das. Bastas das. This is artwork from... Okay. No, uh, let's see, this is from Midsummer. This is the artist uh, Ken never, Salinas. Never saw that one. I'll admit I've never seen nah. it either, but I do love the artwork. Wait a minute! I mean... Yeah, no, it's really pretty. It I'm looks sure like, we just need something more to It looks like he's wearing a bear skin. So well, yeah, but, well, the artwork, it, it reminds me very much of like 1960s kind of um, 
thriller movies. I mean, especially like you know, on, on the artwork for um, the print and everything uh -huh. like that. So yeah, nice. so, cool. Now it's time for the Altagoth. The Altagoth. Halloween, the Curse of Mike. Oh shoot! This is J.C. Brandy. <laughs> J.C. Brandy played the adult version of uh, Jamie Lloyd from. Yeah, it's the Halloween, the Curse of Michael Myers, Halloween Part 6. You always see her at the beginning of the movie and she gets killed off, so... Uh, wow, I wasn't expecting an autograph like that. I mean, that's kind of cool because... That's pretty cool. Well, more fun stuff that we've got. Oh, and, oh yeah, that's Scratch right. off the lotto. Scratch off the lotto. Almost forgot because we're going to have a few of these. Big Bam Box. Big Bam Box! Wah, wah, wah. Oh, bam. 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 Oh, bam. 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 Okay, uh, didn't get it. Haven't oh, got bam. it so far. Oh, bam. Bam it. Well, on from one Bam Box with horror. Now it's time to go into both Hefe and myself's little corner on the street. Bam Geek. Quattro! Our fourth box for this episode is Bam Geek. So. I believe it's still in volume five. This one came in, it was kind of weird because, you know, got a little tape on here. It's barely holding, but this ah, thing this is Ah, this is wide. the circle back about the tape being secure. Yep. Well, okay. Let's get into it. Well, the cool. pin is already out. <laughs> we have Master Shake. Shake Zilla, the mind ruler. Shake Zula, the mind ruler. You want a trip? I'll bring it to you. All right. Let's see. It's our little cheap sheet. Oh. We, got a, we got a license plate in here. Can't use it in Illinois. No, we can use it in New Mexico if we wanted to. Next up, we have a fan select art card from oh, Jason nice. Miller. Jason Miller's been doing a lot of great work. I mean, obviously, with the last one we got with Ash from Evil Dead, he never fails to impress. Yeah, no, I really like his character work. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. That's, I like that. That's gritty. Oh, yeah, very gritty. Next up, we have some Ooh, fan art prints. That's pretty. Oh, wow. man. This is from a series that had <sighs> just the, had a second season come out last month. This is the Umbrella oh, Academy. Academy. Uh, I've, I've only gotten to the first season, but yeah, that is... This, so, like, compared to the comics, it is, it is different. Um, especially with the character designs, and obviously in the comics they were a lot more broad. Uh, but this one was really good. This is played by uh, Ellen Page. She did a really good job in the role. Um, so, like, this is her, like, her power form is that pure white violin. Oh, God, she's so cool. Um, so I really like this. This does a really good job kind of, like, bringing in those, uh, the, I don't know, her power to life on, uh, on Yeah, and this one really comes cool. from uh, Ryan Van uh, Dodgen, I believe. That's how you pronounce his name. Very cool. Now it's time for the autograph. All right. Uh, the, 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 hey, the last one was pretty cool, and this one is... No fucking way, dude. Okay. Nick Stahl, John Connor, and Terminator 3. Okay, that's pretty awesome. That's pretty cool. Yeah, because I haven't really seen a whole lot of Nick Stahl's work. Right. But I mean... Terminator 3, man. I mean, I, I, it wasn't my favorite movie out of no. the world, but it wasn't my least it's favorite It's nobody's movie. favorite, because 2 is everyone's favorite. Well, yeah, but Everyone. I'm saying, you know, when, when you get movies like Salvation, Genesis, and uh, then, you know, Dark Fate, uh, you know. Uh, uh, but don't get me wrong, a lot of people like <laughs> Dark Fate. It's just, I have this thing about, you know, movie series where they act like a few movies didn't happen. Right. But we'll get into that on another date. First things first, after this, another BAM card. Let's see what we get this time, hopefully. Come on, Bam. I think you owe me one after this. Bam! Bam. Game? PlayStation... What? What is it? Four? Five? No. No, no. It just says PlayStation, so... They all have to three do the same. Yep, all three of them have to be. That's it. Uh, celebrity signed autograph. Okay. Well, we didn't win again. That's okay, because we still have a lot more to go through. Oh, that's because the license plate. Yeah. Cinco! So start of our second stretch of this episode, we have a BAM Gamer Box. Let's see which this generation the, of gamers this is the This for. is the first uh, Gamer Box, by the way, that I haven't gotten yet, or that I got that I was waiting on. Okay. And, uh... Nice. Nice. 
This one's bigger than a lot of them, so fan paper. The, wait, oh, there, there's a, there's a box. We finally got a Funko. Oh shit. Oh, dude. Tiny Tiger from Crash Bandicoot. Yeah. Signed, Signed by Bob. <laughs> Signed Brent, by Bob. It's Brendan O'Brien, the original voice of Crash Bandicoot. Wow. I haven't played Crash Bandicoot in forever. That's really cool, though. And his autograph is Bob. Okay, wow. Bam, I know I gave you a lot of crap. He in the did, past. literally, the last episode. He, he was literally talking about Yeah, and you know what? Thank you. You know what? Hey, <laughs> I misjudged you. I misjudged you a lot. So we're going to move on. Okay. Nice. Uh, Bam card again. We're set that to the side. Bam Gamer Fit is. His punch out is Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson. Mike, Mike Tyson. Tyson. Kid Dynamite. Oh, man, dude. Okay. Sorry, Mike Tyson. We do love you. You are the greatest ever. I will say that. And I love Punch Out. I will play that game every day of the week, twice on Sunday. Let's just level up. One of these items in your box is a variant. Let me look over the level up. Variant! We got a variant pin. Very nice. Oh, sweet. Finally, something. Okay, you know what? I'm feeling a lot better. He's things. delivering. It's delivering. For our fan select card from Jason Miller, we have Batman from Injustice. Interesting. Okay. I mean, it looks cool. I mean, it, uh, like you were mentioning about like with the Wonder Woman card yeah. being very gritty. This is definitely... Yeah, and I mean, it's, like, it's, it's very detailed. There. I like his 5 o'clock shadow. Is, you know, <laughs> a nice pose. Very I cool. bet you do. Ah. Let's see what... Oh, for prop leprechaun... Uh, replica leprechaun. We have... A Hillian Shield from Legend of Zelda. How would you even use that? Dude, it's like a belt buckle. No, it's not. It's just, you know, what, hold it? Don't go out there alone. Take that. <laughs> Take this. <laughs> Take this. <laughs> All right. So, oh, nice. for our fan art from God of War. Very nice. The most recent one. Yep. It's really cool. From artist Matt Aiken. Cool. I, I haven't. Nice. I mean, I haven't played God of War in a long time. I mean, like I've played up until like God of War three. Yeah. I, I believe, I, folks, it's been forever since I've actually played consoles. I mean, obviously, when you've seen Game Central Station, we play a lot of things that yeah. are <laughs> emulated. We we don't like using the E word, but it is what it is. And we also have All another right. fan art. The green screen is going to make mess this up a little bit. It's Master Chief from Halo versus, uh, was it Drake? Yeah, oh, um, from Uncharted? Uncharted, so yeah. 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 That is cool. Okay. I was technically kind of a PlayStation boy. I know you're an Xbox. Oh, no, no. You're an I, Xbox I, boy, I, aren't I played you? both of them. I mean, I, yes. You I go both ways. <laughs> I, I played more on Xbox, but I no longer have an Xbox. I have a PlayStation now. Fair enough. Oh, it's just a little. Oh, yeah, little. Card. 15% off or 25% off, so. Very nice. All right, very nice indeed. This one's cool. This one's really cool. I do like that. Well, let's uh, scratch off this ticket. Box. Uh, bam, big box. Bam. Bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. You know One when. of these days. One of these days. All right. Five in the books. Got three more to go. Okay, yes. So for box number six, we have once again from Bam. We have Bam Geek. Bam Geek. Bam Geek. So, I just feel like I'm your hype man. You are my hype man, man. <laughs> You're my hype man, man. Hype man, man. All right. So we have our little cheat sheets. The autographs on top. What is this? Okay, it's a, it's a hat. Oh, shit. It's a, the Sandlot. Oh, man. Okay. Now I have to see what the autograph is. I can't recognize it, but I'm going to check the... Hurry up, Benny. My clothes are going out of style. We are excited to bring you a signed cap from Squints himself, Chauncey Leopard. Nice. That's Ooh. really cool. Squints signed this hat. Dude, that is I, so cool. Dude, oh, that's nice. dude, that's nice. I'm, 
I'm, I'm not. I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. Just put it. Put it over there. Keep it safe because. Dude, Squint is every nerd's hero. He <laughs> kissed Wendy Peppercorn. Wendy Peppercorn! All right. Okay. Yeah, he he was always my hero. Always will be. Bam giveaway. Yeah. Okay, Ooh, we man. have a uh, box. Yeah. I'm safe. Yeah. What's, back? What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? Very easy. Foam. There's foam in the box. Bosses dust. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Bosses dust. We're huge fans of sci-fi series. No Alter Altered Carbon. Okay. No matter who you are, you will always be a bammer. I have not seen this show, but or I heard I. it was really good. Anthony Mackie played the main role in the season two. Um, I have no idea what this is, but I'm now, sure it's now, cool now I've got to go. I gotta watch yeah. it now. I, I feel Netflix. stupid. Netflix, bro. It's oh good. yeah, I haven't seen it either. I've been. It's been on my I, list. Well, I, well, I've been I too busy, to you know, reliving Cobra Kai lately just to get ready for the new season. For the Bam Geek. <laughs> All right. <laughs> it's um. Oh, it's for uh, X. It's, it's well, no, no. It's uh, the uh, X Men thing coming out. Um, oh, uh, New Mutants. Oh, yeah. Th there's a big crossover coming on. New out. Mutants. Let's see, oh, uh, I see the alternate pen Cannonball. Okay. Interesting. I, I had to double check because it looks familiar. Interesting. So nice. I, I'm looking forward to New Mutants, to be honest. Yeah. Oh, fan art oh, wait a card. Minute. Oh, wait a minute! You have the Wonder Woman that's going on the other side. They're yep. facing each other. That's and we crazy. have Cheetah now. I mean, and I, I got that recently too when I got the Marty McFly card. Yeah. As well as the Biff Tannen card. Oh, yeah, yeah. So now I've got both of those. I also have Freddy and Jason. Uh -huh. And now I've got Wonder Woman and Cheetah. That's so, really and, cool. and once again, done by artist, you know, uh, Jason Miller. Let's see. I can see that again. Yeah, Jason Miller. I feel stupid if you keep looking, but it is what it is. So, yeah, I mean, I like that gritty detail. It's really detail. cool. So, last thing is a fan art print <laughs> <laughs> for the okay. new for the new movie that just came out. Bill and Ted face the music. Very nice. <laughs> Let's see. This one comes from Dean McAdam. So, and I, I, I love. That's fun. The characters uh, are fun. Yeah, it, it reminds me definitely of like something you see in like Mad Magazine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's sad that Mad Magazine's gone now. Right. But just seeing something like this reminds me of that, you know, spoofing trope. Oh yeah. So, well, folks, six down, final two. Let's get through. But before I forget, we do have a Bam Car giveaway. Yay! Yay! Let's see if we actually win. 4K. Well, 4K TV. Nope. Celebrity signed autograph. And a big, 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 big box. box. Not a winner. Come on. You gotta let me win something before these episodes go these away days. for a while, you know? I mean, seriously. All right. One last BAM box, and then we got something so, else in. Box number seven. We have BAM Gamer Box. Okay, one more gamer. Let's see what we get. Game out. Game out. More paper on top. Ooh. Bam paper. That bam paper. Tissue paper. We have a signed Funko, another signed Funko. Apex Legends. Um, never played it. Never, I, I don't know. Um, oh, we have another, we have a signed by Mella Lee. There's a um, little uh, card we get from saying about no matter what the day brings, you matter, you mean something, you make a difference. She and put a heart on here, Evan. I think she likes you. Oh, that's sweet. For Firefighter Appreciation Month portion, Bam Box is helping firefighters and first response fearlessly serving in the face of COVID-19 through the California Fire Foundation. That's pretty cool. I like the fact that, you know, some of the proceeds from all of us that are getting this box are, you know, going to something that actually, you know, that's, that's good, you know. Uh -huh. Next up. Oh, dude. dude. Okay, we have <laughs> a stars. stars badge. 
from Resident Evil. Yeah, this is really cool. It's got Raccoon City, uh, Raccoon Police Department, Police Special Tactics, and Rescue oh. Service. This is amazing. Okay. This that, is really cool. That's cosplay worthy right Absolutely there. Absolutely it is. This is exactly like, what that's for. Like that is leather. exactly what it's and for. Seriously, like tap classic. that stuff. Like, oh, I know, I know. That's what yeah, that oh, you can hear it when he drops it, you know? Break my stuff, you I'll jerk. I'll break your stuff, you jerk. Yeah, yeah, you would. So for the Bam Gamer pin, volume one, box two, we have Cloud from Final Fantasy VII. Final Fantasy. I love the pin. I, They're really cool. I, really I, well detailed. I have to get another you know, book bag. I've been telling everybody about this. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh nice. Boy. Hal Jordan. Hal Jordan Green Lantern from Injustice. Obviously, we're going to be cropping this for the green screen so it doesn't get blotted out because obviously... He's full of green! Ha ha ha! Oh, that joke. And. Oh, Battletoads! Battletoads! Once again, the green screen's gonna be shut off for this moment. This is our fan art print. This one comes to us from. Aaron Hazuri. And, uh, obviously, there, there was a Battletoads game that came out recently, I think. Um, oh. I don't know either. No, no. They were talking about it. I don't know because it's just I was watching a lot of Battletoads videos the other day because I was watching a lot of videos regarding the original Ninja Turtles arcade games, and maybe that's why I was thinking something. I don't know. Hey, maybe it's because we've gone through seven boxes and my brain is kind of fried right. There's no lotto ticket. You son of a bitch! Bam! Come on. It was hopeless anyway. Yeah, it was. They're hopeless. like, it was hopeless. Why yeah, are you upset? You never win. I never win. No, it's okay. You know what? You win this round. You win this round. <laughs> you win this round, man. So, apart from that, Rubble Rubble, it's time to go on to our last box from Geek Fuel. Our eighth and final box, ladies and gentlemen. We have Geek Fuel. This actually came today, so <laughs> we're going to have some fun with this one. This one is the Jesus man. Jesus man. It's all so funny. Not even right? supposed to be here today. Just leave this world behind. <laughs> Clerks and Letter Kenny just cross-referenced. We have a kind of classic let's go out to the oh, movies. Yeah. There you go. Very cool. Little leaflet here. I'm just gonna. Oh, I, I, I... I, I, I didn't put my finger on the page. I didn't really see what happened. Much like our last uh, box with oh, the villain's yeah. heads, we have a phone booth, I believe. The We're phone booth. The phone booth box. We're going to open this up very carefully. Let's see what happens. I say it's not tape. Okay, good. Okay. It's a shoik. It's a shoik. Dude, okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wild Stallions 89 Tour. Okay. Wow. This That's just, awesome. <laughs> I thought about getting a Wild Stallion shirt like online, uh -huh. but this alone, I mean. That's really cool. Okay, this me. I'm a fan. I really Go am. Go Ted. Go. Oh, yeah. What you got there? We have Geek Fuel. Two pins. Two pins from Team Fuel. There you okay. go. What do we have here? We have the Beavers basketball jersey, and then we have... Scott, I believe. That's his name. It's been a while since I've seen old movie. <laughs> yeah, but I still love Team Wolf. I just have a so well. But him as the wolf playing basketball. That's cool. I wish I could get a pin that says, What are you looking at, Dick Nose? <laughs> Next up, oh, our action figure from Super 7 Ninja Turtles. Let's see. Michelangelo. Michelangelo, yep. We're going to have to definitely, uh, I'm going to tilt it so the light doesn't take too much out of it. And this is definitely going to be cropped on the green screen, because obviously he'll be blotted out. Gross. Yes, gross indeed. Sticker. Be excellent, excellent to, to each, each other. And party on, dudes! Yes, do that hard too. I, I, I love Geek Fuel stickers. Yeah. One more thing in here, and... Geek Fuel... Okay. Dude. It's a Goonies. What? It's a, it's a Goonies puzzle. <laughs> it's a Goonies puzzle. It's a Goonies puzzle. Because I, I, cool. I looked at the, the, the font and I'm just like, what? 
that it looks so familiar and I'm... 300 piece puzzle. Oh, I know exactly what I'm doing when I move into the new place. This is going to be, this is going to be done. This looks really cool. Oh Really nice God. design. Really cool. A lot of props and stuff from the movie. It's great. The pinchers of pal. Or <laughs> pinchers of peril. There you go. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we did eight boxes as quick as we could for you today. We hope you enjoyed this episode. Leave a thumbs up if you liked what you saw. Leave a thumbs down if you think you saw something that you wish you would have saw. Other than that, we make sure that you go on the websites for all of these products, with it, whether it be pro wrestling crates. I mean, they've got a lot of great stuff with a lot of great deals. We also have the BAM boxes. I mean, whether you're a horror fan, whether you're a geek fan, whether you're a gamer fan, I mean, there's there's things for everybody. Which if you I like to collect about. stuff, they'll give you stuff to collect. Oh yeah, and also with Geek Fuel, I mean, they are definitely the pinnacle of a lot of different tropes. I mean, sometimes you get a little mixture of everything. I mean, what, I mean that one, if you really want a little bit of everything, Geek Fuel is definitely the one to go to. But if you're one that just likes one type of genre, go for it. Other than that, be sure you share on social media, and as always, push that little red button. Red like the box. And don't forget to ring the bell for instant notifications on Dragon Fire Entertainment. Also, if there's anything you want to see in future videos, leave a request in that comment section below, and we'll be sure we get it to you as soon as possible, and leave you a shout out in the process. Until then, I'm Wildman West. I'm happy. And we will see you next time on Dragon Fire Entertainment. Take care. Be safe out there.